Hi there, I'm Eddie Field with Field Guide to DIY. Do you know someone who's a teacher, tutor, or speech therapist who needs a sneeze guard table divider just like this one? Well, in this episode of Field Guide to DIY, I'm going to show you step by step how you can make a sneeze guard table divider just like this one. Let's dive in. Step one, cut your stock. We'll have a complete cut list in the description. You don't have to have a chop saw, you could use a handsaw or a jigsaw. Step two, cut your groove for your plexiglass. Now here's where a table saw does come in handy. Step three, drill pocket holes for screws. Now you can nail, glue, or screw your frame together. Me, I just found another use for the Craig pocket hole jig. For a complete step-by-step -step tutorial on the Craig pocket hole jig, click the link above. Step four, glue and screw two of the four corners of your frame. Step five, test fit your plexiglass. Step six, cut your base pieces. You can see we put a little 45 degree angle on the ends of those. Step seven, cut out a shallow notch out of the base pieces to receive the frame. Again, this could be done with a jigsaw. You just cut a series of grooves and knock out the waste with a chisel or a screwdriver. Step eight, sand before staining. Step 9, stain the frame and base pieces. As fast as it goes on, you take it off. Get my staining shirt. I don't think I'll be wearing that to the prom anytime soon. Ooh, jacket bean. God, that brings out that pine grain. Step 10, insert the plexiglass into the frame. Step 11, glue and screw the remaining corners of the frame. Okay, like 90% of you are now saying, why didn't he just miter the corners? I don't know. And step 12, fit into the base pieces. You'll see the frame fits right in those notches. Actually a little snug, but that's better. For more DIY how-tos, click the image on your screen right now.